Hey streamers and welcome back to our YouTube channel. If you're new here and you just got here because of the create your very own video streaming website on WordPress series, this is the first part. So in the first part, I'll be showing you how to go live on your WordPress website. The second part coming next week is how to create a video on demand. Then we have to set up monetization on our live streams and video on demand. And we'll also include how to enable your regular users to go live on your WordPress website. So kind of like Twitch. So the first thing is getting a theme on your website. I have signified dark and you can get this under the appearance section of your WordPress admin. But we also have a few demos listed that we also created video tutorials on how to set these up. And I'll also link everything down below so you can check out these demos for yourself. So this first one is for all of those who want to set up their yoga website and set up classes, workshops and live stream. The second demo is the bridge demo. So this demo is specifically for gyms out there or even personal trainers. Um, you can add uh, program schedules, products in the form of live streams or video on demand to show your workouts. In the third demo, we have the Devagora theme. So this is for all those fitness instructors out there. I've also set up this uh, video player to show you how it looks like. The fourth one is for the news or magazine websites. You can also set up video streaming on these types of websites. And the very last one is for those who have faith communities, churches, mosques, and other uh, faith organizations. You can get this demo or check it out in the link down below. But yeah, basically once you have checked these out, purchased the theme you want and implemented it on your WordPress website, you are basically on a good start to create your video streaming website. The next step is going to your plugins and clicking on add new and here we'll type WP stream. So WP stream is a video streaming plugin that you can use to broadcast live events and sell tickets or recordings via WooCommerce. So make sure you install and activate the plugin. Once you've installed it, you are ready to continue by going to WP stream and clicking on credentials. And of course, the first thing you'll need to do is register or log in if you already have an account on WP Stream. So this is how our website looks like. You will click on get started to create a new account. So of course, you'll add your email address and your password and then register. Now you'll find your free trial package and you can also confirm your email address for an extra five gigabytes of streaming data. But let's go back to our website and add our login details and save changes. Now we'll go to free to view live channels and click on add new. And here you will add a title for your live channel. So I'm naming it live stream, simple as that. You can also add a bio so for example i'm typing in come with me on my busy day you can also add a featured image this is always helpful add any categories tags just so it would be optimized um, seo wise and have it made easier for people to find your website and find your live channel so yeah, I'm adding a few tags. Media categories and yeah, once we have completed all this, we'll click on publish. Now you'll see that your channel is off. You can't go live yet, but you can change your channel settings. And from here you can find things like record live stream, display viewer account, lock to website and things like that. I want to record my live stream, so I'll enable that. And in the next video, I'll show you how to take that recording and create a video on demand from it. But 
we'll just be focusing on going live. So I'm turning on this channel and once it has turned on, you can decide if you want to go live from the browser or using an external streaming app. I'll use the latter. And here you can see from a drop down menu all the different options like OBS Studio, StreamYard, Restream and things like that. I'm using OBS Studio, which is a free pro tool that you can broadcast live events. So go to settings, stream, and you'll find a server and stream key that you can copy from WP stream into the respective sections here and click on OK and start streaming. Once that's done, go back, exit this pop up and click on view channel. This will take you straight to your live stream and this is how your live stream looks like. You can also go picture in picture, full screen and things like that with your live channel. You can also go back and share your channel directly to Facebook, Twitter, WhatsApp and things like that. And once you're done streaming, go back to OBS Studio and click on stop streaming. This is how your video player would look like and you can change the text on screen as well. And that is basically it on how to go live on your WordPress website, how to set up your video streaming website and in the next video which comes out next week make sure you check out how to create a video on demand from that live stream recording i hope you've enjoyed this video and the first part of this series hope to welcome you back soon bye